क्वेश्चन नंबर एट टू रेस कार्स कार एक्स एंड कार वाई आर एट स्टार्टिंग पॉइंट ऑफ अ टू किलोमीटर ट्रैक एट द सेम टाइम कार एक्स एंड कार वाई मेक्स वन लेप एवरी सिक्सटी सेकेंड एंड एवरी एटी सेकेंड रिस्पेक्टिवली इन पार्ट वन वी हैव टू फाइंड हाउ लॉन्ग इन सेकेंड विल इट टेक फॉर बोथ द कार्स टू बी बैक एट द स्टार्टिंग पॉइंट एट द सेम टाइम and in part 2 we have to find how long in minutes will it take for the faster car to be 5 laps ahead of the slower car so first of all in this question we have we have two cars car x and car y such that they are going on a race for a 2 km trek and car x completes its one round or one lap in 60 second while, while the car y completes its one lap in 80 second and in part 1 we have to find how long in seconds will it take for both cars to be back at, at the starting point at the same time so we just have to find that in how many seconds both of the car will be at the starting point after racing so we just have to find the lcm of 60 and 80 so in part 1 first of all we are going to factorize 60 and then we are going to factorize 80 So the factorization of 60 is 2 3s 6 2 0 0 and 2 15s 30 3 5s 5 1s 5. So 60 can be written as 2 times 2 times 3 times 5, and then we have to factorize 80. 2 40s 2 20s 40, 2 10s 20 and 2 5s then 5 1s. So we have two times two times two times two times five. So this is the factorization of both of these values, and now we just have to find the LCM of these two because LCM will give us the because LCM will give us the time in which both of the car will be at the starting point at the same time. So then we have to find LCM of sixty and at which equals to so for lcm we are going to list the common factors times the non common factor so the common factor here is 2 2 and 5 and the non common factor will be 2 2 and 3 so first of all we are going to write the common factor which is 2 2 and 5 so 2 times 2 times 5 and then we are going to write the non common factor which are 3 times 2 times 2 which equals to 2 to the 4 times 3 fives a 15 times 4 which equals to 4 into 15 will be 60 60 times 4 is 240 so it will take 240 second for the both car to be back at the starting point at the same time so we can say that it takes 240 seconds for both cars to be back at starting point at same time and then in part 2 we have to find how long in minute will it take for the faster car to be 5 laps ahead of the slower car so we just have to find the amount of time in minutes in which the faster car will be 5 laps ahead of this of this slower car so in the part 2 we just have to multiply this lcm with 5 because in this 240 seconds the car y which is the faster car will be 1 lap ahead the car x So if it takes 240 seconds for car Y to be one lap ahead of the car X, so for five laps ahead we just have to multiply five with the 240. So time to be five laps ahead will be five times 240. which equals to 1200 seconds and we have to find this value in minutes because in question 
we have to find the time in minute so in the next step we are going to divide 1200 divided by 60 so it will be changed into minutes and 00, zero will be cancelled 26 20 is a 120 so it will be 20 minutes so in 20 minutes the faster car which is the car y will be five laps ahead than the car x so it will take 20 minutes which is our answer so if you are new to our channel please subscribe the channel like the video and share the video